so this currently 12:44 and i've started the trek or walk or run to castle rock station so let's see how long it takes me to get all the way to the station um 15 16 kilometers let's go Just now on the way I met a uh, few people they were trekking from Castle Rock which I wanted so I just asked them at what time they left and then they said 11 o'clock so right now it is around 2:30 or something so they've trekked for about three and a half hours to reach the place i am at and i am still not even one fourth of the distance so that means they still have uh another they still have another one and a half hours in ahead of them and then i have at least three hours ahead of me but they said that you know no matter how slow you walk you just need only 2 hours to now i don't think so this is way harder than i thought you've got to halt and eat some sweets when it starts raining right now it's raining and then i luckily found this christian temple i don't know what you call uh so i was able to sit here i forgot an umbrella dude anybody who goes to dutsaga don't forget an umbrella because that is important mm -hmm. some office was taking pictures and some people some railway workers working
हेलो सर कैसे हैं आप खाना और कितना दूर है इस्लाबाद के लिए और इधर से नाइन किलोमीटर नाइन किलोमीटर अच्छा देखने को दिया देख लिया ना कहाँ से बैंगलोर से बैंगलोर कैसे दिया नहीं नहीं Holy fuck look at this damn and the other side is like that and this side is like this big ass hill i'm guessing this tunnel is going to be long as fuck Another 10 minutes, I might probably be on the Karnataka and Goa border. From there, Castle Rock is at least one hour. I just want to reach Castle Rock before the sun sets because I know it's gonna be fucking dark, and it's really not safe to be on the tracks when it is dark because I've been running through these tunnels, right? you can't see shit and it really takes away from the fun uh trying to find where to keep your leg and all that so top most priority is to reach castle rock before sunset This this is the last tunnel for the day. Uh it's probably the shortest as well. This is 93 meters. The one that I this is the first one so from Castle Rock this is the first one. The second one is half a kilometer long. That was painful to cross. It was something else. Anyways, seeing ninety-three on the board makes my heart smile. There we go.
finally reached Castle Rock. Oh, it's a different feeling. I have a whole new respect for flat land right now <laughs> because oh man walking on that it's difficult so I have a whole new respect for pavements roads anything that's smooth and flat <laughs> there's not one body part that is not hurting right now so what I'm gonna do right now is go freshen up and uh, I, I don't know, I badly want a Coca-Cola. Don't you think I deserve a Coca-Cola? I do. It's gonna be one noisy sleep today. <sighs> so got this here at the station, two samosas. There's no coke. Sadly, but I'll settle for this. This almost as well. Yum. <clears throat> so the time is currently 11:54, and the train is scheduled to arrive here at 1:30. I still have to wait for one and a half hours, and I've been waiting since four o'clock. Solo and all is good, but then. In times like this, you need your friends, uh, you know, to stay together to figure out what to do in all this free time and all that. So that is one place where I'm missing my friends right now. And apart from that, you just saw how difficult the fucking track was. And then when I entered, there were two cops on the side. So one of them pointed at me and said, uh, look, this guy walked all the way from Dutsagar. And then that's it. So they did not speak to me, I did not speak to them and that's it. Around 6 or 7 there was a commotion like 6 or 7 boys, they went to the, uh, the cop came to them and then the boys went to the cop and then there were a couple so they were walking back and forth between the cop and wherever they were sitting. So I was wondering what would be happening. So it turns out they were all fine for walking on the track. So around 600 per head or I don't know, um, for the whole group. These cops never spoke to me. I was sitting right beside them. You know, as soon as I came, I, I bought the samosas, right? I was sitting right beside them. They did not ask me anything. Yeah, so people who do this trek, I know it is illegal to, to begin with in the first place, but make sure that uh, You've got a good explanation when once you reach Castle Rock. I don't know, not promoting misbehavior or anything like that. But anyways, we made this trek possible. Uh, I just have to wait another one and a half hours for the train to come and then I am out of here. See you, it was a beautiful trek. Let's do more of these and if you like this video, please don't forget to like, share and comment and also please subscribe. Thank you.